Okay, part two is now given us a different function and it's asked us to differentiate, it's asked us to find dy by dx. So in order to do that, we need to bring the power to the front and take one off the power for each turn. So if we bring the power to the front here, we're going to get 5 times 2 over 5, x to the 4. I'm going to tidy all this up afterwards. I'm just going to make sure I get a method mark first. Same thing here. 3 comes to the front. Take one off the power. 50x... When we differentiate just an x to the power of 1, we just get the coefficient because the 1 turns into an x to the power of 0, and x to the power of 0 is 1. So we've just got 50 there. And this one is just a constant, and we hopefully we know that constants just disappear because their gradient is 0. So if we just simplify my answer now, 5 times 2 over 5, hopefully you know that they're going to cancel. So that will give us 2x to the power of 4. Same thing over here. They've not just picked those numbers randomly. They've picked them on purpose because they know they're going to cancel. So we're going to get minus 20x squared and we're going to get plus 50.